guys. So I've got something that I want to tell you and this is going to be a surprise for Alex. I don't want anyone to know except by the time you guys see this it's already going to be done. So we've been talking just a little bit that uh, we were going to post some more videos about our infertility stuff which we were going to and we still are. We've just got a couple more appointments that we have to do and then and then we'll explain it to everyone. But it's been real stressful this whole time. Uh, we've been trying to keep ourselves super busy by working. Alex works full time in the school, has her photography business, built that up in, from scratch. She built that up from nothing and she's been working super hard and I'm really proud of her. Um, but things just get really stressful around the house, especially without uh, being able to have a baby at this time. So there's been one thing that Alex has been wanting for years and years, and this is honestly the only thing that I have ever told Alex no on, and that is getting a puppy. So I'm gonna surprise her. There's a couple of puppies pretty close within about a half an hour. So I'm gonna go get, get one of those puppies. I'm gonna basically tell her I'm planning a date night, and then I'm gonna, I'll talk to you guys a little bit on my way to get the puppies, but they'll stay the night at Roxy's house, which I'm gonna do this later today. They're gonna stay the night at Roxy's house, and in the morning, I'm gonna get Alex up really early and, and uh, surprise her with, first off with breakfast, and then I'm gonna give her her surprise. So she's gonna be super happy. Hopefully you guys will get to see that. I'm gonna film everything, but She's worked so hard and she's had that fertility stuff going on and that's super stressful so I think having a puppy will really, really help her out. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. We're gonna surprise Alex. You guys get to be there and watch it. We are gonna start doing kind of weekly posts. We can't do daily just because we're too busy with the hearing clinic and with teaching and also with the photography business that's been blowing up lately and we're really grateful for that as well. Um, so stay tuned and you're gonna see this all happen. So, Alex, I love you, I hope you enjoy this video, and I hope you enjoy your new puppy. So, we'll see you guys soon, thanks. Hello? Hello. All right, so I told Alex that we that I'm setting up a fun date for tomorrow. Okay. But she'll probably uh, call you to see if you're in on it, so I'll just tell her you have no idea. Yeah, I have no idea, I haven't talked to him. Okay. All right, guys, so I just told Alex that I had to go plan our date for tomorrow. We're trying to do a little more videos just to kind of document what we're doing for ourselves so we can go back and watch all the fun times. But I told her that I am planning a date for her tomorrow, and I am planning a date for her tomorrow, but she does not know that I'm actually going to go get a puppy. So leaving the house with the camera made her a little suspicious but I just wanted her wanted it to be a surprise all right so let me wait for the focus so I just uh, met the breeders of the Morkies I don't know if you can tell this but I'm petting a Morkie right now do you want to see her this is the little Morkie and so she's one of the smaller ones. She takes a lot after the Yorkie, but full grown, she'll probably be three and a half pounds. And she's probably about two pounds, almost pound and a half maybe. But this is the Morky. She doesn't have a name yet. I'm gonna let Alex, gonna let Alex name her. But I have to get home. I'm running a lot later than what I told Alex I would. But she, she might be a little, a little upset, but as soon as she gets this cute little puppy tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, give me kisses. Then she she won't be sad anymore. Look at those kisses. Look at those kisses. So, I have no idea what's going on but Austin insisted that we leave the house at 7 a.m. this morning on my day off, so. <laughs> and then he made me clean the house. I don't know what's happening, but I can tell you one thing. 
that whenever I married Austin Lee, I knew my life would never ever be boring ever again. But whatever it is, you know it's gonna be the best. I know, that's the thing because you never do anything like halfway. Everything Austin does is like always so good. Oh, look at that sun flare. Sun flare. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna go to breakfast real quick and then I'll give her the surprise after breakfast. So you guys already know what it is. What? Why did they get to know? But I hope that she really loves it. So I'm so curious. We're gonna eat breakfast. We're not gonna film ourselves stuffing our faces because. But if it's a trip to Hawaii, I'll be, I'll be okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> It's a trip to Hawaii. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're going to see you guys after breakfast. Stop. <laughs> no. All right. I need you to wait here. I'll text you when it's safe to come in. I'm nervous. What did you change? <gasps> to get pissed. She's been denied enough last time. Is she really? Yes. <laughs> I thought we were going on a cruise or something. <laughs> we were coming back. I was like, wait, so we're not going to the airport? <laughs> it's exactly like what I wanted. I know. Like the perfect, is this a, is it a morky? It's a morky. <gasps> Here we go. She doesn't even look and she's real. Like, she's like a, kind of like a teacup morky. What the three, heck? She'll get Where three did and you a half go yesterday? Fall over. Oh, fall. <laughs> oh my 